Next, we go to dysbiosis, which is basically saying that the bacteria in your, of your microbiome, which is the 60 to 100 trillion organisms in your colon, dys means off, right? And so you've got too many bad bacteria, not enough good bacteria in your colon. That leads to the inflammation. Now, why do you have the bad bacteria? All the dietary things I mentioned. And then in addition to that, we have what's called our gut brain axis, which is how the gut talks to the brain. And what's key about this is a lot of times when we have our digestive complaints, we also have mood issues, we have anxiety issues. So the way the gut ties into the, the brain is pretty fascinating. Uh, serotonin is the hormone that 90% of it is actually manufactured in the gut. And so we always thought that somehow magically <laughs> the serotonin that's produced in the gut got to the brain, but then research pointed out that it doesn't cross the blood-brain barrier, so it actually doesn't traverse to the brain, but there's a signal. So this is quite fascinating. Um, so 90% of it is made in the gut, 